My name is Africa Gonzalez Fernandez. I am medical doctor and professor of immunology in the University of Vigo here in, in Spain. Uh, I joined just very recently to the PCE and I am really looking forward to establish collaborations with different groups and, and to increase the critical mass uh, uh, trying to fight this, this problem that is the pancreatic cancer. Well, I knew PC thanks to, um, to Nuria Malats, that is a person that is working in the PC and, and also she is working in a, in a platform here in Spain. So I thought that could be a very good opportunity to, to know other researchers around Europe, um, to have opportunities to know what they are doing, uh, how we can, we can help. I am immunologist myself. I am uh, I'm working in the um, immunotherapy and I thought that maybe my expertise could be useful and also that I could learn from other people working in, the, in, the, in this uh, network. Well, I have just started very recently, so I, I didn't have the opportunity to have any meeting in person, but I have received the information. Uh, I have been uh, checking uh, through the, the web page and I think that is uh, is very active. And I, I think that we can have many opportunities um, being and integrated under, under the umbrella uh, of this institution. Um, that we can join efforts and and to try to to find the different actors uh, trying to find the a solution of of the the pancreatic cancer. So that I think that um, I would like to be more involved. Um, I I have started in this is in this field uh, not many years ago. So for me it's, it's encouraging, and I would like to to be part of this and to to be more involved if I can. Well, definitely there are many challenges. As as you know, pancreatic cancer has not been uh, they they didn't have benefits from new treatments. Uh, there is not much evolution in the last 40 years. Uh, many drugs and, or many immunotherapy that were working for other tumors are not working in, in pancreatic cancer. Mm -hmm. So I think that there are many challenges. One is to understand better the tumor, why this stroma is so de desmoplastic and is so difficult to, to go into all this uh, microenvironment with this immunosuppressor uh, effect uh, and also the, the, the tumoral cells itself. So um, I think that the to target this cancer, we'll need new approaches. Mm -hmm. We have to think in a new way, um, just not in this um, trying to change um, drugs. Maybe we can think in a sequential treatment uh, and we should include uh, in, in different, different uh, aspects, for example, uh, and this is what we are recent doing research, trying to target the pathways of proliferation, also trying to decrease the stroma, uh, trying to improve the immunotherapy, and um, uh, also uh, to induce an immune response, an effective immune response using vaccines. I think that just only the combination, but the right combination in a sequential way, maybe we can fight the, this this terrible cancer. Well, I think that we first of all we will have an increase in the critical mass. So many different researchers and people thinking in the same aspect, no, with the same goal. I'm sure that um, between us uh, we could. Um, trying to find uh, maybe new ways in a different uh, a different thinking that we were doing with other type of cancers because we we were not going anyway so um, i think first the the 
the, just the, the thinking. The second, the, the network and to have more patience uh, because uh, usually uh, the, the pancreatic cancer is not the most uh, frequent. So sometimes you don't have enough samples uh, to, to prove what you want to to use. Um, so to, to increase uh, through Europe um, and to integrate as many groups as, as possible, we, we will have more numbers and this will um, provide um, more results um, and more information. I am thinking, for example, in transcriptomic, genomic, uh, proteomics, in all this, uh, we need a large number of patients to, to do it. So um, it's the only way is to work in collaboration. I think that research cannot be done just in one lab. We, can, we have to share our results and we have to collaborate and to establish this network. And I, I believe that PCE is providing that. Uh, there are definitely some some new things that uh, have come recently, like for example, immunotherapy using vaccines with uh, RNA, uh, and also uh, there are some advantage with um, a CAR T therapy uh, directed against some molecules uh, on the surface of the pancreatic cancer. Um, I think that we are now in in in, in a new in a new way. Uh, and with some successful. So I think that the combination, I'm sure that the future will be, as I said before, the combination of different therapies and immunotherapy is going to be one of the of the main issues as, as what we are seeing now with good results uh, with the RNA vaccines, with the CAR T therapy uh, and, and maybe new, new drugs. For example, we are trying to uh, investigate in the epigenetic inhibitors um, in collaboration with the blocking some of the routes of activation uh, and with immunotherapy. I think that these three three ways together mm -hmm. maybe is, is, uh, could be the solution. I hope, I hope. Well, my my message will be that we are working we are working for them, mm -hmm. uh, trying to to find a better life um, and a cure for the pancreatic cancer, so that they should be uh, patient. Uh, that um, all of us, uh, our effort, our time uh, is, um, and we are dedicating that to them. So that's uh, it's uh, our goal actually.